Hello, my beautiful YouTube friends. Letty here, Living Life with Letty. Welcome to my channel and Happy Easter. If you're new to my channel, I hope that you will stay. And if you're so inclined, please subscribe. And don't forget to hit the notification bell. So you'll know when my next video is going to be. In this video, I am going to show you a little embarrassing moment. Yeah, a little embarrassing moment. My um, door, my slider door on the passenger side would not open. And it wouldn't use the, the key fob. Um, we tried and tried and Sherry came and she tried and it was just not, it wasn't responding. I could hear the other doors click, but I couldn't hear that one click. Well, luckily there's a young man here by the name of Zach and he's a little guru when it comes to RVs and solar, electricity, doors, whatever needs to be worked on. And I called him and he came and I was sitting in my driver's seat when all of a sudden I heard him say, Letty, Letty, Letty. Oh my God, I wondered what I did. So what did I do? Did I do something to break it? And he said, yeah, kinda. He said, there is so much dirt in the sensors. There are little three sensors, which I will show you. Um, and also, and they were so covered in dirt that the sensors weren't communicating, um, you know, to get the door open electronically. And these doors, if you can't get them open electronically, you're gonna, you know, uh, in, a, in bad shape because there's no key or anything that will open them, only the key fob. Anyway, he did fix that, and then the other thing I had him look at was the seal on my Max fan, because the guy that installed it a year ago made it very clear to me that it needs to be resealed every year to prevent it from leaking. And I know it's been a year. I had it uh, installed last April, so I thought, hmm, maybe I'll have Zach look at it, and it's a good thing because it was already cracking in a couple of places. He did take a picture, but he wasn't able to send it to me uh, but I but I did get to see it where the seal is cracking um, due to the weather, you know, the sun and, and stuff like that will make it crack. So he did reseal it for me again. So I'll be good for another year, hopefully. Um, so come along with me so that you can meet Zach and also so you can see about what I'm talking about, um, the sensors um, in the door and the door, also the door lock. And he did grease it with... Um, that what you'll see, you're gonna see some white covering and that is uh, lithium grease. And I happen to have a can, so he greased everything for me. So now the both doors are opening great and I am so grateful. Thank you, Zach. Anyway, come okay, along. So this is Zach. Zach is a uh, expert in RVs. He can pretty much fix just about anything. He knows a lot about solar, electricity, um, my, as you know, as I mentioned before, my doors wouldn't open and I thought, oh my gosh, what am I going to do? It was one door that got totally stuck and he came and he fixed it right away. And it was really embarrassing because it was really dirty and that's why it got stuck. Anyway, so this is Zach. Hey. <laughs> so, uh, Zach, I'm going to mention you, well, I already have in the video and I'm going to put, do you have an email that I can give out or... Hmm? I, I didn't make it. Okay. Well, what you can do is if you're interested, if you're anywhere in the Mojave Desert or anywhere near and you need any work on your RV, um, leave me a comment and I will go ahead and get you his information so that I can put you in contact with him. Okay. Well, thank you so much, Zach. I really appreciate it. And he also did the seal on my uh, Max fan because it was cracking already. Yeah. Yeah. Put some fresh backboard down. Yeah. Okay. Thank you so much. This Bye -bye. Is, that was all jammed with dirt. This is actually the other side, but they're both identical and they both were very dirty. And down here, you have these little sensors. See those little sensors? They need to be clean because then they won't communicate with these little, let's see, where are they? These little three things here. Um, let me see if you can see them. I'm trying, yeah. Uh, where are they? Yeah, those little three things there. And, uh, and then he greased. That's why it looks white. Also, he greased everything, you know, to make it look good. So that's what happened. Well, I hope you enjoyed today's video. I hope you got something out of it. So remember, if you do have a van uh, with sliding doors, 
um, and it's similar to the picture that you saw of mine, make sure that you clean it. Clean it at least once a month real good so that it, the same thing doesn't happen to you. Uh, thank you so much for joining me today. Uh, again, happy Easter to everyone. I hope that you're all staying safe and uh, may the sun shine on you today and every day especially on your solar panels and that that nasty thing that's going around too. I love you all. Bye-bye.